all right guys so welcome back to another video so today i'm going to be doing a product review uh i was sent this uh to test free of charge from uh this company called gonex it's actually an umbrella and uh the reason i want to test this out is because i had uh, a really bad experience with umbrellas on the course normally you fit it into here when you play uh golf for the course and a lot of times what happened to me it's uh, as soon as the wind starts blowing, uh, you know, the umbrella just kind of just flipped and everything. And so it's always been messy. Now, uh, the manufacturer here, uh, this company, they made these umbrellas that are quite big and they actually have two layers. So I'm going to be testing that out and, and see how they perform. Also in the summertime, like now, um, a lot of golfers, uh, we use it as like a shade. You know, when you're out in the court in the fairway and you have like no shade at all. So this, uh, we're gonna test that out and see how much shade uh, you actually get. So stay tuned. All right, so the product did come in a proper box and it's quite long, as you can see. It's a big umbrella. The company is called Gonex. I will put a affiliate link below. Um, let's see how how it is. First time I open it. It's got a plastic bag around it. And it's black. I'm curious about the layers because uh, it's supposed to have two, two layers. So it does have a cover right here. So that's also interesting. And you can also use it to carry if you're not using it for golf. So uh, you can just take off the cover. And there it is. There's two layers here. So you open it up from the top and bottom. And let's see how it works. Just a little there we go okay so that feels pretty 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 sturdy and as you can see there's two layers here so what happens is when there's a lot of wind um, you kind of uh, the reason why the umbrellas normally flip is because there's only one and there is no air or the the wind doesn't penetrate so this right here as you can see my hand probably there uh, it will prevent that so as far as the shade uh it does block the sun so you know if you are in the course and you're waiting for your turn you can just chill right there in the shade so this is a good thing definitely it's a it's a large umbrella so uh you definitely have space to stand right here wait for your shot so you don't have to uh, go into the woods i normally go into the woods because it gets really hot in the summer so all right so where i live right here right now it's pretty windy so this, this right here, right now it's, it's quite windy, so I can pull it this way right here, or normally uh, I would do it the other way around too, so. Like this, you can go. Yeah, that's pretty good. I prefer it this way right here, at that point. You gotta be careful always to here with the trees, you don't wanna break it, but yeah, this is, this is really comfortable. Obviously the ultimate test will be with rain and wind. Okay guys, so it does look very nice. Uh, you can see here the two layers that I was talking about, right here where uh, it would just allow the air to come through. This right here is really sturdy. It's some kind of fiber now. I will put obviously the description on the bottom, but I'll tell you why, it does look nice. This is the adapter that you need if you want to fit it into your cart right here. So it's looking really nice, guys. All right, so you can definitely adjust this. So uh, the only thing, obviously, if you're really tall, I'm uh, 5'11", so if you're taller than that, it might be an issue, but you can just uh, adjust it here, get something uh, here. Okay, so I would not obviously take a swing, but uh, you could uh, just get ready and kind of like rehearse your movements right here, even while you're waiting, you know, um, without doing the full swing, obviously. But right here, I tell you what, I'm sheltered by the, by the side, you know, from the suns. Okay guys, so I think it looks really nice with this setup right here. Uh, if you're looking to buy an umbrella, definitely uh, look this up. I'll leave a link below on the, um, on the uh, Amazon affiliates. Uh, now, like I do with all my products, I will test them out. You can ask me how they, you know, over the time, if they last, if they break, whatever. I'm always open to, uh, to answer any questions. I will probably do another video. Uh, right now, there is no rain in the forecast, so but as soon as we get, we get some range, I will definitely uh, take it out and put it to the test to see, you know, if it really does hold up. And I'm really curious to test this double layer system. I'm not sure if, I think, yeah, most large umbrellas have it probably, but um, definitely look into this. Uh, also, I think 
the main two uh, features of the umbrella is the, the double layer and the, this fiber um, uh, rod right here that holds the umbrella, which is pretty sturdy. So I can definitely see it. It's a little windy here, so I'll go really fast so you can see how sturdy the product is. Okay, so I'll just give you a little bit of a uh, preview here on the material and you can uh, see here this is the the shelter that you get right there you can see that uh it's pretty sturdy this material right there so you're definitely block it definitely blocks the sun and this system right here seems pretty solid as well i'm not you know obviously i'm not an expert on umbrellas but um uh, like i said the main problem i think on umbrellas is uh not having this this layer here where um where it could be a problem when there's when it's too windy just as a regular umbrella let me just give you a perspective how, how it would be with uh, if you're just using a uh, an umbrella so it, it's a large umbrella as you can see very very large yeah definitely so this is a large umbrella so i don't think the wind is going to be a problem i just have to test out the wind and rain i think stable uh now obviously it depends on the adapter you have here this is a I got this uh, from Doomlob, so looks pretty solid. Actually, you can actually erase it just a little bit if you want, but if you're like my height, 5'11", I wouldn't, I wouldn't mess with it. I think it's better to not to like force it too much. So, but you can erase it just a little more if you like, um, if you want a little more space. Okay, so something that I have to tell you, as far as the shade, I've been here already for like 45 minutes, and I tell you. Uh, if I'm in there, out in the sun, it is, you know, it is hot. So it does provide you shade here. So it does work, uh, especially when you have some wind. So that way you kind of get, uh, you cool off, you know, without the sun. So uh, if I'm over here, I can definitely cool off as opposed to if I'm over here. Yeah, see, I, definitely. I know it's, you know, maybe not that much shade you think, but uh, it does, it does help you especially if you're out in the course so as far as the shade i would say definitely um it definitely works okay guys so that was it for the review uh we'll definitely take it out to the course and i will let you know how it performs especially when it rains so uh but i do have to tell you with this setup it does look it looks really really nice you know it's like it completes the setup i think so uh but i would like to test it out in the rain and in the wind uh, out in the course so hope you like the review thanks for watching until next time